Hello everyone. Welcome to One Minute Learning Show. The aim for this show is to make learning fun, quick and effective. I'm your host Kushbu and today's topic is how can we avoid false positive ductus venosus A wave reversal. On Doppler ultrasound, the flow of ductus venosus shows triphasic waveform where in the normal physiological situation flow should always be in a forward direction that is towards the fetal heart triphasic waveform comprises with s d and a wave have you ever come across a situation where you are getting a false positive ductus venosus a wave reversal and wondering how can i avoid such situation let's hear something really interesting directly from our mentor dr s pradeep in just 1 minute we can do that by understanding the bright peak sign the ductus venosus is too close to the ivc and when the sample box collects information from both the ductus venosus and ivc we will get the bright a wave reversal from the ivc falling on the ductus venosus and appear as a false positive sign look at this doppler the ductus venosus waveform is gray in color and the superimposed ivc waveform is bright in color so the normal a wave reversal of the ivc appears as a a wave reversal of the ductus venosus so by comparing the signals we can avoid a false positive diagnosis of ductus venosus a wave reversal 